My name is Aubrey Wexler. My position is Director of Employee Engagement on the HR team. And I've been with the Mats just shy of five years. A very tough job to describe. I always say, uh, to simplify it, my job is to make sure that the employees here are safe and successful and happy. Really anything that affects a employee's life cycle, uh, whether it's policies, whether it's planning our family day, uh, I do get involved. I always joke that there's nothing too big or too small. I'll sew on a button for you or I will answer your questions about our handbook and, or lead an investigation. I worked in healthcare and transportation. I expected to uh, be a criminal lawyer. That's where I was headed and had a challenge early in my career uh, that led me into employee relations. And I hadn't been in my last job terribly long when I got an email from my best friend and uh, the subject line of the email, which I think I still have, said, your dream come true, because it was the job I'd been doing and gained this expertise in doing uh, here at my favorite place in the world. I had the opportunity, and at that point, I went in full force and for the first time in my life said to myself, I'm going to get this job. No one's gonna get in my way. Uh, I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna pass up this, this incredible once in a lifetime opportunity. I think it's important to have diversity in the workplace for a thousand reasons. Um, I think, you know, when people think of diversity, they think about it in a classical way. They think about race and age and gender. And of course, those things are vitally important, but there's so many other aspects to it. If you're of a certain age and a certain gender, if you're coming from a certain area of the country or the world, if you've been working for five years or you've been working for 15, and if you layer all of those different types of traditional and non-traditional types of diversity together, that's when you really get an environment where people can learn from one another, can teach one another, um, can find similarities in a world where that's not always possible, and create an environment like this one where teamwork is really the backbone of everything we do. The diversity of the people here and the qualities of the people here have really been my best opportunities to learn. My mother uh, always worked and when I was in high school she started her own business um, and she had that business for over 20 years successfully. Uh, she also had a, the same business partner who ha she had worked with you know in years prior and I learned so much about the way that they operated, how much their integrity and how they did business was always the, the premier and most vital aspect to their work. Such great role models to have throughout you know those formative years of my childhood as I was heading into college and, and into the workforce to have them there. Uh, so I'd say Jamie Wexler and Barbara Saunders. Thank you guys. The advice I'd give to a young girl looking to break into sports is, of course, it's competitive. There's a thousand people who apply to every job we have here, but there's so much power in positive thinking, so much power in that belief in yourself. My mother always said to me, somebody's gonna get that job, it might as well be you. Why can't it be you? And that really did um, bring me a confidence in my application for this job that, that I might not have had elsewhere. Um, and it really does make a difference if you say to yourself, I am going to do this, I am going to get this job, I am going to be my best version. And even if it doesn't work out, at least you know um, that you left it all on the table and that uh, you, know, you have no regrets and it helps you in the next thing, the next opportunity, the next application to a sports job, uh, and someday you'll find yourself there.